Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Johanna. Today is Wednesday, August 26, 8.51 p.m. I did work in the office today, so it's another late start. I would like to check on Rhonda and Pinky, um, more so because I want to see what the inside of their house looks like because they are starter villages. I, I know it's not going to be their actual house, but I, I'm still curious. Oh, there's our buddy Spork. I am. Too big to see across, but too small for a sea monster attack. You're just so smart. Okay. So, I like the outside of her house. That's, that's really pretty. I've never seen that before. <laughs> I like the music. I was way in a DIY zone. What you up to? A show rug. I dreamt the idea when I fell asleep watching Mag Loops in Love. It's about trains in love. Oh. <laughs> Maglev Mike? <laughs> I don't think I know how to make that. Oh, you're a pop star Peppy. I think that's what they're called. Thank you, my dear. Considering the music and the outside, this definitely isn't what your house is supposed to look like, but it's still pretty cute. Oh, you're right. You're busy. Okay, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> so cute. I think I'm gonna like her. Alright, and... Oh, no, that's his house. I think this is... Rhonda's not home again. Nooks. No. Resident services will be upgraded tomorrow, which is good. Oh, we have a bird, so we have an announcement. September 3rd is a... Oh, he has a birthday. Oh, that's what? A week from today? No. It's Thursday. Next week, Thursday. Oh, okay. Well, we definitely need to get him something awesome. Alright, so I do want to pick up this fossil. And we have a bunch of stuff that I left outside to give to Bladders. He should be updated today. But before I forget and it gets too late, let's go talk to the boys, see if there's anything cute to buy. But more importantly, see what turnips are. Okay, not much going on here, but let's see what turnips are. Oh, this is horrible. <laughs> What's the hot item? The potted ivy. Do I even have it? Well, I want to get this tea set. Okie dokie. Now, I was deciding on a direction for my island. My original one, I'm thinking more of a suburban country, but this one I think I'm going to lean more towards a, a country artist retreat. Again, there's going to be lots of flowers, lots of trees, but I'm hoping a different vibe. Still not going to be accepting any outside help, although my friend Andy has <laughs> wanted to send my character clothes, which I get. Uh, I've been wanting to send this character uh, some furniture and some money, but no, we're going to 
we're just gonna do things on our own more so to see what we can do if this were just a solo game I actually really like this one but we don't have a lot of bells and if I remember I'll show you the inside of my house because I changed the floor I don't think I did anything else so none of these things we're going to get which is a, a bit of a bummer because I want some pretty things boys why, why you gotta be like that Now there wasn't anyone in residential services courtyard and so that means there might be an NPC wandering around. And as you can see I actually got a lot of stuff. I did do some diving. Um, I did do the quest for Gullivar, so actually we can check our mailbox as well, but, oh, my to total squirrel moment. So for the artist, um, country, country artist thing, um, I don't want to do any terraforming if I can help it, though like I've talked about, I'm not a huge fan of that. Oh, I have worked so hard tonight of the lake that looks like a bone or the, the yeah yeah we've talked about it <laughs> I didn't even read any of what he said do I have any fossils all right guys I finished donating things with the lathers so we're gonna see what kind of nook miles we got And that looks to be it. I'm going to clear up some of our inventory. Oh, let's talk to you. Hey, Renee. Got tons of foods I've never heard of. I'm trying to come up with me meals for as many as I can. What foods? <laughs> There's peaches. Unless you're into sea fish. Oh. Food. <laughs> Seriously, what is going on today? I want to push you in the lake. I think that's the Miyama one. huge fan of the shell stuff. <laughs> oh, why can't you give me ironwood stuff? I love that stuff. Bamboo stuff. Fan of that. Not sure how big that is. Ooh, three by three. That's it's not small. Uh, Cause that just looks like a bathroom rug to me. Oh, Red is back. Sorry, Red. I mean, 
Let me put this away before I shovel you in your face. Hey, cousin. <laughs> you know, I have another island that you've said that to, so... What? Completely, as if they were family. We are, seriously. Twice removed on our mother's side. Yes. Oh, we're just gonna go there. Now. Okay. Oh, I thought we were gonna go there now. Thought I was being kidnapped. Nook does that stuff all the time. All right. For so. No, I'm gonna leave the shells. I don't know if we're gonna be moving trees, hunting webbits or anything fun like that. You know I'm still looking for sharks. Okay. I showed you guys this yesterday. I'm thinking this must be something coming up soon. Although, honestly, I don't know. And it's a cute little boat. I'm not gonna lie. I wouldn't mind it parked there. Illegal stolen art or not. Okay. Hello, cuz. Then find your rare art. A piece of art per day. I know it's a hassle because you come here like every other year. Alright, well, let's look at some of the stuff. Quaint painting. And then a closer look. I'll get close to that. Now, I know there's things you can check online uh, to see if something's real, but I don't want to do that. It looks good though, I don't see anything strange in it, although the other side of this is, if it is fake, I wouldn't mind that in my house. Okay, oh, okay, well I do see something I want, so we'll look at all the art first. Moody painting. Closer look. Okay. Again, I don't know if that's real, but the first one we looked at definitely looks cuter. <laughs> I don't know if the shoes are wrong. I don't know if the bag is wrong. This might be completely the real thing, and I just. I don't know art, which is also a thing, so we're gonna skip this one. Okay. Dynamic painting. Come on, help a cousin out. That also looks right. I want to say that the Japanese paintings usually have a red seal on them. Um, but again, if this were fake, I wouldn't mind this in my house. But it looks like a style for the Japanese paintings, and that looks like Mount Fuji in the back, but I think they should have a red seal. I'm not going to look, so I don't know. But I'm still leaning towards the first one. But I like to look at them just because um, Animal Crossing does actually a really good job 
of replicating very closely to the real thing. Wild painting left half. <laughs> Who are you shipping to? I wonder if 4980 means something to Animal Crossing. Okay, so that's a little scary. I think it's a demon. Oh, so we're not gonna get that. Alright, we are gonna get this one. I like this one. Good, we have bells. thing I wanted to get is the grill. The charm and elegance of the very finest pear juice wrapped up into a barbecue. I think this is a metronome, and I think they just had one of nooks. Yeah. No. Alright, well that's all we can purchase from him. Alright, I wanted to show you guys the map, so let me move this to the airport. It just gets it out of the way. Sort of. Okay. So right now my house is where the pink is, and we've got the villagers there, we've got five villagers on island. When Nooks opens up tomorrow, then we can see if we can either sell some land and get some more villagers, do the campsite, or whatever. But instead of waiting until we have all 10 villagers to start decorating, I think we're going to start decorating areas now. And if we use the trick like I'm doing here in the campsite, then we can at least start mapping things out. Now you see where the bone lake river thingy is at the top right. Uh, I think that's where I'm going to put my house and I think I am going to terraform uh, quite a bit of the bottom of it so where it spills into the dark green closed. And not terraform but just close up the lake um, because I just I don't like the shape of it and I might make it a little bit smaller at the top so that there's just more usable land. But for the most part the rest of it I think I'm going to leave. Um, and then I think the rest of what I'll be doing with the island is just moving buildings. Like I think I need to move the museum a little, a little farther back. And I think I'm going to move nooks across the river from the museum. But I'm not 100% I'm not sure because what can't move is residential services. So I don't know if that'll just have little areas for the artists to go by because like I've mentioned with editing I don't know how much of it I'll keep in but I do want this to be like a country artist retreat and so the houses might be all up on the top of the island and then just lots of woodland area on the bottom I, I I'm thinking that's what I'm leaning towards now and it just then also depends on where I'm going to put the commercial center. If I want to keep it to the lower left on the other side of the river, like I mentioned, with the museum. If I wanted to put it around residential services, if I wanted to put it by the airport, 
again I'm still thinking about that but that's the direction I'm thinking of going and so in future videos what I plan to do is just pick little sections now my house will probably be last because I need to unlock terraforming and more importantly the waterscaping in order to fix that but the rest of the rivers and things they actually look cute to me I also thought about straightening up the river where the museum is and having it just come straight down but if you are new to the game or if you're in the game and you're just not a huge fan of terraforming or if you haven't unlocked terraforming I do want to see to the best of my ability of what I can make this island look like with minimal to no terraforming waterscaping cliff building or anything like that I think it might be fun and it definitely would be different than a lot of the islands that you see here on YouTube because YouTube gives you a microcosm of what's popular on YouTube but that doesn't mean it's indicative of what the 22 million people who will purchase this game how they play it oh look a money tree <laughs> well that's always nice to come across Alright, well, let's just make that good. We just made 30,000 bells. Hooray for us. And that's a hardwood tree. So, I'm always just carrying around too many things. Because I kind of want to continue to move the apple trees. but I think what we'll do is it's going to be a short video and for these ones after work where I'm working in the office and I just I come home tired it might actually stay that way but for the videos that we can do uh, when I am working from home uh, those might be a little bit longer and while there'll be some editing to this video again I I, I like to show just playing the game. Oh. oh, I should throw myself in the river. Oh my goodness. It's, oh. <laughs> it's just frustrating because I feel like I've just lost money. I mean, I literally just lost money. Even though I just got free money, I just lost money. Ugh. All right. Oh, hey, Renee. Okay. I'm not going to feel like the reason you just walked away is because I ran up. I mean, maybe you saw that mistake I just did and you're disgusted, and I understand. But still, I'm not going to let it hurt my feelings that you just walked away. But Golovar sent us something. Let's see what it is. All right, so what are you doing? <laughs> Pirate fans? How does that look different from the other pants? It doesn't. I mean, one has yellow on the bottom and one has my skin. At least you're not watching me dress. Oh, I want the blue top. Yay. So, I want to show you the floor. And then that'll be the end of this video. And then I'm hoping tonight, when, or tomorrow night, when I am working from home and I can get on a little bit earlier, that we can start actually mapping out and more so doing some decorating. Because I, I find that fun to both watch and I find that fun to do. And then what I changed in here was I did add another song to the wall which is that one right there still don't have a player to play it on i did get a hamster and so 
keys right there and then I did change the floor the floor before was like a wooden floor and I think this one goes better oh and then I did put this rug down I am going to look at the furniture that I can make because a wooden block one you can customize it but I don't necessarily like the colors you can customize it to so I might do these but <sighs> struggles always with getting the wood these that use hardwood might be the way to go just because it's easier I think to get that although this is hardwood so we might use that for the table and chair and maybe we can customize a bookshelf because I, I I remember looking at the options and I didn't I wasn't really drawn to them because I think they're the same as in Renee's house and I'd rather just have all dark wood the bed if we can get the furniture to be dark but the walls and the floor to be light then I think the bed can stay and that's just less resources we need to do but yeah so that's going to be today's video I'm actually going to go back out and do some resources or farming of resources so that when we jump on tomorrow we can start making furniture item and things and I'm going to actually go back to Nooks and purchase some flower seeds from the cabinet so that we can start um, doing flowers as well because they do take a few days to grow. All right, guys. Well, not a super interesting video. Um, and until we start unlocking more things, I don't know that it, there will be that much interest but I hope you enjoyed it definitely leave me a comment down below of what kind of content you like to see and from my island to yours Aloha